Good afternoon, my friends. So for those of you that are wondering when you will receive a fourth stimulus check, new deposit dates have just been announced. Our lawmakers are stating that there is a new deadline for Americans to claim this extra money. There are also new eligibility requirements that have to be met. So my friends, please make sure to watch until the end of this video if you want to receive your relief check before the deadline. Also, do make sure to share this video with your friends and family if they need more reliable stimulus news. Friends, if you would like to enter my $75 Walmart gift card giveaway where I will be giving away three $75 Walmart gift cards, please make sure to listen for the keyword in this video. America has had many recoveries in the past, but underneath those recoveries, there's also been a lot of lasting pain. Lots of folks never get back on their feet when they're knocked down so badly. And a whole lot of young people saw their futures dim from the previous recession. They never got back on their feet. It's what economists call economic scarring. Chronic pain when the economy comes back, but some folks are still left behind. Trapped in long-term unemployment eviction and foreclosure. Research shows that when you're stuck in that cycle, it has the worst impact on your emotional health than the loss of a family member, which sounds excessive, but it's true. And it's serious. So when I came to office in the midst of this crisis, I was determined. As this crisis continues to sweep across our country, millions of Americans are seeking financial relief from Congress or their state government. But the good news, friends, is that our lawmakers are finally taking action for us, the American people. Ilhan Omar wants to implement a plan that would help families stay afloat in these economically tumultuous times. Omar, who is a Democratic representative from the state of Minnesota, has officially introduced an income plan that will distribute monthly checks of $1,200 to families throughout the United States. According to the Huffington Post, with the sponsorship of representatives Dwight Evans, Cori Bush, Jamal Bowman, and Pramilia Jayapal, Ilhan Omar wants to create a $2.5 billion grant fund so that the program can begin running. The program will allow for monthly checks to be sent to different communities. And once the program starts, $1,200 payments will be sent to adults, making up to $75,000 per year, and heads of households who rake in $112,500 per year. There will also be an extra $600 sent for each child in that household. So for those who do not have a bank account, you will not be left out either. The Support Act will help establish a banking system using the Postal Service so that you can receive checks in the mail. Representative Omar's hope is that legislation like the Support Act will help families meet all their needs. Representative Ilhan Omar had said in a statement, for too long we have prioritized endless growth while millions are homeless, hungry, or without health care. We as a nation have the ability to make sure that everyone has their basic needs like food, housing and health care met. Representative Omar's hope is that legislation like the Support Act will help American families meet all of their basic needs. While Ilhan Omar is introducing legislation that will guarantee help for American families who are in financial distress, the Biden administration is still negotiating on President Biden's Build Back Better bill. Others are pushing for monthly stimulus checks to be issued until the crisis ends, while other representatives are recommending fourth and fifth round of payments. There are several change.org petitions that have racked up millions of signatures, urging and requesting Congress and our president to act and provide further economic assistance to millions of Americans. While the White House is still negotiating, Democrats have touted the expanded child tax credits, which are included in the American Rescue Plan. The popular policy has doled out $300 per month to parents of children 5 and younger and $250 per month for children aged 6 to 17. 
Many Democrats, including House Speaker Nancy Pelosi, are pushing for these monthly checks to be permanent. So friends, should the expanded child tax credit become permanent? Please leave your thoughts in the comment section below. The United States government has sent billions of dollars in stimulus checks to Americans since the onset of this crisis. Yet some people may still be asking, where is my money? If you feel that you have been left out in the lurch, there is a way to claim the missing funds. Submitting a tax return this season can help if you are still owed the recent $1,400 stimulus payment. It can also help resolve the situation if you are missing either or both of the first two checks for up to $1,200 or $600. And this is all according to CNN News because there are advantages to submitting early. And this is according to CNN News. Remember, there are advantages to submitting your tax return earlier. For one, the sooner you put in for any missing stimulus money, the sooner that you may receive it. However, friends, it is important to remember that even though you are due a stimulus check, you may owe taxes that are more than that sum. If you decide to take a tax filing extension, you have more time to submit your return, not to pay any money that you owe. Interest and penalties may accrue on any balance that you owe the Internal Revenue Service. Each stimulus check comes with its own set of eligibility rules, especially with regards to phase-outs above those income thresholds and dependent eligibility. To find out why you may or may not qualify for the money, the IRS has information on the first $1,200, second $600, and third $1,400 payments on its website. Friends, the keyword for this video is Labrador. If you would like to enter this coming Friday's Walmart gift card giveaway, when I'll be giving away three $75 Walmart gift cards, please make sure to click and like my videos. Comment below this keyword in the comment section below and additional keywords from any video of mine that you watch. And please do make sure that you are also subscribed to my channel. Thank you so much, friend. As the IRS processes tax returns this season, each week it's deploying additional money in the form of new checks to people it did not previously have on record, as well as plus up payments to those who previous checks fell short. Well, my wonderful friends, you've come to the end of my daily stimulus update video. Thank you very, very much for everyone who is watching and who has joined me here today. I greatly appreciate all of you who are watching my videos. Please friends, do me a favor and share my video with your friends and family. If they need more reliable and accurate stimulus news information, thank you very much and have a wonderful and blessed Monday.